Lizzie Colson from Manchester Valley is a lacrosse player. After graduation, she's going to College Park to play with the Terps. And Lizzie is the Gardner Wolf Student Athlete of the Week. Here is Jamie Costello. Lizzie Colson was four years old when she touched a fiddle stick for the first time. But in elementary school, she almost put the stick down for good. I don't want to do this. Like, I want to do gymnastics. Well, a great coach did a handstand to convince her to come on back in middle school. And her lacrosse playing sisters also played a role. And I watched my older sister grow up and play lacrosse. And I was like, oh my God, I want to be like her. And in the backyard, Lizzie wanted to get better. How do I pass behind the back? They'll help me, like, shoot behind the back. And they'll say, like, Liz. How can I get my arms up on this pass? You know, it's just someone that pushes you. But who pushes Lizzie? How did she end up second in the most goals scored in the history of Carroll County Lacrosse? I don't, I honestly couldn't tell you where the personal drive comes from, but I just like get an adrenaline from it. Like, I'll have a goal, I'll get there, and I'm like, okay, what's the next one? Lizzie's not a talented lacrosse player by accident. She puts in a lot of time, and her teammates see that, and I think it pushes them to put in that time and dedication into the sport of lacrosse. Always pushing herself to get better out here, and in here, where her grade point average is 3.5. On the wall every day, at least 10 minutes. Um, sometimes I come before school. I only do that so I can get Dunkin'. I go to Dunkin' Donuts. And Coach even admits that Lizzie has made her a better coach. You don't get the type of player that Lizzie is every day um, in your program, uh, but she also pushes me as a coach. She makes me better. Um, obviously, I have to keep up with her, you know, so when she comes to practice, she comes into a game and she's doing all these great things, we have to figure out a way to challenge her and to continue to push her. And after all those years of looking up, now she looks back on a great career and looks ahead to playing for one of the great lacrosse teams in the country. It's kind of intimidating going into, like, such a great program, but I don't know. I'm just excited to make an impact on it and you know, have a part in that. Lizzie Colson, congratulations. And now we are all looking at you, wanting to be you, for you are the Gardner Wolf Furniture Student Athlete of the Week. And you can check out her story and stories of other athletes on our website at abc2news.com/athlete. We'll be right back.